Hi everyone, and in this video, I want to share with you a comment from a subscriber, and she asked for um, a way how we can automatically, I mean, how we can turn off the automatic updates for cPanel or WHM web hosting control panel so um, if you're new here um, welcome to mavix.com and I create videos in regards to make money online through the web and currently I've created actually I have an ongoing um, course and one of the video videos is this one which is how we can install cPanel and the subscriber wants to know how we can turn off automatic updates for the web hosting control panel by cPanel um, maybe because I have I probably have mentioned it um, in this video and and I'm going to demonstrate to you how you can do that easily through the SSH and okay to start with and before and before we go through the process by the way I want to explain to you why you would want to do it um, for me personally I do it I turn off the automatic updates so that I can decide on my own when I will I will want to upgrade my server because most of the time when cPanel upgrades and if you let them automatically up upgrade your servers and let's say you are a shared host hosting reseller or maybe you have optimized your server with a lot of modules or plugins and maybe they are not up up maybe they, they will get conflicted for the new update and it will it might crash your server surely and most of the time based on my experience it does there's a lot of bugs for when you let cPanel automatically update your server and we all know that there there is no way you can do it as you can see here I'm in my w, WHM cPanel so if you go here um, let's go to this one upgrade the latest version we do have an option oh no sorry let me check here the, I believe this one <coughs> excuse me <laughs> so we do have an option to select what tier we would like to um, to choose let's say for example if you want stable um, stable is any other th tier but the problem with this is that cPanel I mean you don't have an option to turn off the automatic um, update which is for me personally from using the the, the platform or the, the the panel for quite some time um, I've had an experience with shared reseller hosting uh, um, before I've just sold my business last year um, uh, if I, I were to ask I would really recommend you to turn off the automatic updates so that you don't get any bugs and for me I usually only update when I am sure that the the release or a version release is already um, there's no any bug or I can completely say that that it's it's been um, tested 
for enough people okay so also if i don't see any problem with if from from all the forums um i mean for the cpanel forums and then any other plugins that i use if i see no problem then i i upgrade but if it's not necessary then i don't but the problem here with uh, with your in the option in your dashboard option you don't have any um turn off option here so to do this you just go and log into your um, ssh i am using ssh bit bitvice and if you're not familiar with this please do um check on my channel here just you just try to um just um check this video out i have um walked you through through how you can ch you can use bitvice and also i have another video I, I do have a lot of videos in regards to ssh just try to check on that so when you log into your ssh um client let me clear this one go to um um run this code here nano this is the editor and then this um path here in this file we will need to edit something here so just press enter and you will see this um values here uh, the, the, this this is the content within that file so what you want to do is you replace the daily values with never okay never never and then and then go to your whm and then check on your version here the exact version you are in okay make sure to to copy this one let's say 102.0.14 let me see here so erase the release one 100 zero two zero 2.0 14 is that correct let me check again 14 one is okay so that one and then save that one through through selecting um, CTRLX for Windows. I'm not sure with Mac. And then just try to search if you're in Mac. And then hit on Y and then enter. It should already been saved. So to check that one let's go back to the editor to the file and here you go so please pay, pay attention here okay so as you can see this is the current one if we refresh this because we already have changed the file in the um, cpanel configuration refresh this page here and then as you can see we have a warning and what is the warning all about automatic updates are disabled for the server we strongly recommend enabling automatic updates so if you want to enable the automatic updates because you want to um as you can see by the way as well um we are in the custom tier already with the version that we have so that's how you can um, actually disable um, automatic updates with cpanel i don't i mean in the past year or the past um, time that i have used cpanel when i i was starting out i've searched a lot of um i've searched in on youtube and any other um, blogs or so I haven't 
I, I'm surprised that there's no content about this on the web or maybe it, it just doesn't rank but I hope this um, content helps you out in regards to um, to avoiding the bugs of of cPanel which is really annoying when when you are um, in a serious hosting business this is really recommended that you turn off your automatic updates so back to our question um, here you go um, Ali Ace or Ice thank you for your question and I hope I have answered your question and if you haven't already please subscribe to to this channel and any other any other questions please um, um, place your comments down below and I also I also appreciate you liking this video and subscribing to this channel and cheers everyone thank you um, I'd like to shout out Joshua here um, yeah, he he comments hats off for your works. This should be a premium course, but here we get it for free. It has helped me achieve my objectives. Thank you very much, Joshua. It really helps me out when you comment like this. Um, this is for the video install C panel for free in Oracle. So. Um, I hope you, you can check this out as well. This is a free um, option for hosting and as well as this one. This is for serious um, server hosting from Contabo. And again, guys, see you in the next video. Thank you and take care.